This visual mnemonic will cover trait theory of personality, as well as one of the most important trait theories, the five-factor model of personality. There are a handful of different personality theories, so it's important to not only understand each theory, but also to be able to compare and contrast the different theories against one another. I don't know about you, but studying for the MCAT makes me hungry. Good thing we're stopping in at Five Factor Burger for this scene. Oh, wow. Five Factor Burger sure has a lot of portraits on the wall. See all these portraits? The owner of this shop takes a picture with each celebrity that visits his restaurant and then hangs the portrait on the wall. Not an uncommon restaurant practice. Coincidentally, these portraits should help you remember the trait theory of personality. Portrait for trait theory. You can't spell portrait without trait, right? Trait personality theory posits that personalities are composed of traits, which are habitual patterns of behavior, thought, and emotion. It's a lot easier to understand what traits are with an example, so we're going to take a step back and examine where we are. Hmm, I love Five Factor Burger. It's salty, greasy, and always hits the spot. On the note of trait theory, though, this five-factor burger should help you remember one of the most popular takes on trait theory, the five-factor model of personality. There's actually a few different approaches on trait theory, but the five-factor model is by far the most common and therefore the most important to know for your test. Now, you can see why those poor traits are in five-factor burger. The five-factor model poses that there are five big traits at the core of your personality, openness, conscientiousness, extroversion, agreeableness, and neuroticism. You can remember these traits with the acronym OCEAN, but in this scene, we'll give you our own better way to remember these big five traits. But before we dig in, let's touch on one high-yield fact about trait theory and the five-factor model in general. Take a closer look at the owner's portraits over the years. Even though many years have passed, our owner still looks exactly the same. You might even say that his portrait is stable from year to year. This can help you remember what traits are, intrinsic characteristics that are stable over time. Because of this, trait personality theory sees personalities as intrinsic and stable, since personalities are themselves composed of intrinsic and stable traits. All right. All right, let's move on to the first big trait in the five-factor model. Ah, huh, it seems the owner's posing for another celebrity portrait now. It's no wonder he brings all these celebrities in. He's so happy and agreeable. Our boisterous, <laughs> outgoing owner should help you remember the first big trait in five-factor theory, extraversion. Extraversion, also called extraversion, is exactly what you think. The trait of being outgoing, affectionate, and sociable. If you want to be successful in the restaurant business, you've got to be pretty extroverted, right? There, another picture taken for the wall. It looks exactly like the other portraits, handshake and all. What a stable and intrinsic pose for the portraits. The owner always shakes hands with his celebrities because he wants to make sure they feel welcomed. Speaking of the handshake, it should remind you for the next big trait, agreeableness, because a handshake is just another way of agreeing on something, right? Think about business handshakes after signing an agreement or something. Anyways, the trait of agreeableness is characterized by compassion, kindness, and a desire to please others. Our owner is definitely an agreeable guy, kindly shaking the celebrity's hand to ensure they're pleased. The owner seems to be having a great time, but the celebrity seems a bit nervous, if you ask me. She might be overly worried about making a good impression, and rumor has it that she is a bit emotionally unstable. In this scene, the celebrity represents the next big trait, neuroticism. And come on, aren't all celebrities a bit neurotic? It's just really hard to cope with all the fame, okay? Neuroticism is characterized by being nervous, worried, and emotionally unstable, just like this celebrity. To remember neuroticism, just think of this neurotic celebrity, and you should be able to remember how it is characterized. All right, now you're asking why we always come to this five-factor burger. I love this place because it's always open late. See that sign on the door? This open sign represents the next of our five factors, openness. An open sign for openness. 
Easy, right? Open signs can help attract new customers. Maybe someone will walk by and decide they want to try a new restaurant. If so, they are probably high on the trait of openness, since openness is characterized by being open to new experiences and wanting variety in your life. So, in order to remember openness, just think of this open sign and its ability to attract new, open-minded customers. While the owner has a great time, the employees have it rough. It's really hard working in a restaurant that is always open. See the guy wiping down the condiment counter? What a hard worker. At this rate, he may even win employee of the month. Here, this restaurant worker cleaning the condiments is exhibiting the last of the big five traits, conscientiousness. By the way, doesn't the word condiments also remind you of the trait conscientiousness? They're the conscientious condiments. Conscientiousness is characterized by being hardworking, organized, and careful, just like this hard worker cleaning the condiments. Yeah, he's being careful to clean up every last spot. Just remember this hardworking guy cleaning the condiments for conscientiousness in the five-factor model. All right, that's it for trait theory and the five-factor model. Let's summarize. Trait personality theory posits that personalities are composed of intrinsic traits that are stable over time. One of the most popular trait theories is the five-factor model of personality. This model proposes five big traits that make up personality. The first, openness, is characterized by open-mindedness and willingness to try new things. The second, conscientiousness, is characterized by being organized and hardworking. The third, extroversion, is characterized by being outgoing and affectionate. The fourth, agreeableness, is characterized by kindness and a desire to please others. The fifth and last big trait is neuroticism, characterized by being nervous, worried, and emotionally unstable. And that's it for Five Factor Theory. After learning so much, I'm definitely even hungrier. Time to grab a world-famous burger. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this one, click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also support our team by visiting pixarize.com, where you'll find exclusive videos and interactive review images. If you like what we're doing, share with your friends on social media, and we'll keep making great content like this. We'll see you next time.